Yeah, I mean, why is a wonderful thing, but why is the point of curiosity if you really think about it? If we really kind of break it down, mm -hmm. the real window why is curiosity. So when when and it's a good question I do get asked, like Dan, I'm looking at my marketing. How do I really kind of dig in? And I say there's three fundamental pillars that will break down marketing for you. Currently, if you think about how everybody looks at marketing, they look at marketing. I look at my paid search. I look at my, you know, traditional whatever. And I go, how many cars did I sell? How many eyeballs did I get? <laughs> yeah. Right. So I, again, I'm breaking a simple level. I'm sure there's many dealers watching going, Dan, I'm far beyond that. I know you are just follow. So there's three pillars though, that play into this. There's the inventory, which is kind of the bell of the ball. If you don't have the inventory, then you're not selling anything. And that's why your car dealership is cars, right? Sell them and fix them it is at the simplest level. So if I'm not understanding what my inventory mix is, my count, how I steady that into how many cars I'm going to sell, I can do all the marketing in the world and I'm never going to be happy because I'm not going to sell any more cars, but I'm going to blame marketing instead of looking at the fact that I have an inventory problem. Mm -hmm. So now I check the box, right? My inventory, got to be honest about it. Great. Now I come into the marketing piece and I go, okay, Based on this, I'm going to execute on this marketing, whatever your strategy might be, what your agency, you know, suggests, whatever. And then you execute and you don't really get the result you're looking for. Now you got to look at the end result, right? The people in the process. So based on what came through the CRM, based on what I can calculate as far as opportunities came to be, did the people in process fail? And I have to check that box first before I go back and blame marketing. So marketing mm -hmm. is almost the last stop of what's really wrong because you got to look at the both end caps and go, do I have the inventory and do I have the people in the process to truly maximize the dollars I'm about to invest in moving inventory and filling my fixed ops 